So what was your relationship with alcohol before you joined the comeback? What was that like? Before I joined the comeback, I was, uh, you know, started off kind of in different stages. I started out, um, you know, casual, and then I started kind of using it too much to cope with the way I handle my life, to relieve stress, to, um, you know, how to get real, just to get away, I should say. Get away from what? To get away from business problems, life problems, to, you know, any of those things. So just uh, to escape. Escape. Since you joined the comeback, what is the relationship with alcohol like now? How's your, how's your life? Let's hear some results. I do oh my gosh. I got it back. And that's the God's honest truth. I really did. Yeah, I was heading down. Luckily, I hit the brakes quick enough that, you know, I mean, I was, I was still going to work. I was still doing the things. I just wasn't executing the way I know I can. And now I am, you know, um, you know, setting goals, just just being back to where I was at, you know, before I started down that hole. What do you think is the biggest gift you received from giving, you gave yourself, essentially? You did the work. Yeah. Uh, I'd say my health, my mental, my mental clarity, you know, you, you uh, and setting the goals. Like you hit that spot, at least I did, that it just, uh, I was just kind of self sedating every day. And now I'm just kind of looking at, I haven't even scraped the iceberg of where I'm going to go, you know? And so that's where, that, you know, it's huge. It was huge for me because I do I have one little girl. Yeah. It was never bad. You know, I was always, I, you know, I want to say that's the one thing I was always a good father, but um, it's better now. Better now because like, I know where I want to set the example because I don't want her going down this rabbit hole, you know, that I did. So, so if somebody was on the fence or worried about joining the comeback, maybe like you, maybe yeah. <laughs> at, the, at that initial time, right. what would you tell them? So I remember when I signed up and I was driving and I was heading to a job that we were doing and I stopped and I called and I saw, I saw the Facebook ad and I was like, oh my gosh. I was like, I talked to your brother, Kurt, who's an awesome dude. And I, I was thinking to myself, I was like, I just gave, you know, I just paid for something that I have no idea because I never researched it. I just did it on complete faith. I really did. <laughs> Hung up the phone with your brother. And then, like, I was just like, God, you're an idiot. What, you know, what would you do? And then two seconds later, that text came through from you, like, literally two seconds later. And I was like, this is it. This is, this is, this, this is the program. You know, and um, I don't have any other programs to base it off of. I never, you know, went to any other things, you know. It was a personal thing, like, that I just battled inside, you know. I don't tell, t talk to people about it, but, um, yeah, it was huge. So you got your life back. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Not perfect, but back, for sure. You know, you always battle the struggles, so.